one bug. I might just take the scooter, you guys. Who was it that brought those drinks? Because I remember that. Phil. 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 Mm. And then apparently that epic meeting Ethan had. Oh, yeah. Phil thought like Ethan was telling Phil that he was fired. Because it was directed at him. I don't know. I honestly don't know how that That's makes exactly sense. how I felt at the latest meeting. Yeah. Oh, I like, didn't show up the next day because he was fired. What? What the hell? I like, called Sean and he said like, they can't fire you because it's so hard to find support team. So he was like, okay. Wow. The epic meeting was the best thing ever. I mean, if they would like allow people to ro work remotely, it would be re really easy for them to find a support tech, but they won't. So, you know, they're doing that shit to themselves. I mean, like, there's nothing around. Like, that that area is so, like, dead. I mean, there's gates, and, like, that's it. And, like, that's not even that close. I mean, what is it, like, a 15-minute walk? I was to walk remotely. I was just going to, like, this place. Friends along it, I wanted it for, like, $600. You look like a king. <laughs> yeah. Victoria Park. Oh my God, can we go faster? about dropping my uh, water bottle down there when we came up. Some documentary footage here. And John, John's uh, road to 100. <laughs> it's the most boring documentary. Just hours of me biking this trail. I'm like, I'm going to the theater and watch it. It's kind of long. Like, you know, we were sitting here the whole time. We're in a box of I just pass out in the middle of it and I'm sleeping on my trail for like an hour. You should like bring five red bulls and just like drink them like one after the other before it's dark. <laughs> I think uh, right at the start would not be a great time. I just pulled all night or drinking and shit. I keep getting 
Swamp. Yeah, that was a Bentley. I think he can afford the speeding ticket. Or maybe not, maybe he spent all his money on his car, so <laughs> no more money for a speeding ticket. <laughs> Was that? Yeah, I see people going back there as well. Yeah. If I have enough time. The trail was spotted, so there's like a 50% chance that they can make it through the whole way, but it's still a full, full way to try. What do you mean that it's what? It was spotted. Like oh, oh, what? It may not be at this yeah. point already, but we'll see. The If you watched my video from yesterday, the. Um, Fieldworth Trail still flooded. Yeah. I was like, oh, you know, I've got like bigger tires now, so maybe I won't get my feet wet because the week before I had gotten wet. I didn't really think through like the whole water displacement thing. The fact that I had wider tires meant I got more wet, <laughs> not less wet. Well, that's fine. I mean, it wasn't cold, so. You in town uh, July 4th weekend? What? July 4th, are you in town that weekend? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you guys had the fifth off? Yeah, so it's not. Yeah. What was that? So I have no idea what it is. Yeah. The fourth is on Thursday. Oh, perfect. So then we get a fucking four day weekend. Yeah. Fourth of July? Yeah. Is it Thursday? Yeah. Oh, there. What day is what? Uh, that's a Monday. Okay, so I start on Monday. You'll at least have that Thursday do off, I would think. Off or just Sunday what? Off? Do old people have Friday off? No, not everybody has the Friday off. You'll just have to look at your. Did they give you like HR stuff or? I don't think I have to do that. It's like nine days. I counted for nine days. So yeah, that's not very many. I mean, it's not like yeah. terrible. It's just. It's uh, basically like that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad. It's just right. not a lot. I think ours is 11. So, I mean, you know, we're, it's not that many more. Oh, yeah. It's like 
5th of July and then one extra day in Christmas. Yeah, prob probably. Although we will get like the whole week of Christmas off, probably. Oh, uh, I see. Yeah. Plus those those aren't official like on the HR website though. Yeah. Last three weeks PTO. Yeah. 17 days. I wish for force like it sounds like a cool company, but I wish they would let me like start in Cali, then move to Minneapolis. It's like work remotely, but they're very like particular with what they want, so it's unfortunate. Yeah, I mean they just want someone to come here. The um I think they're trying to build up the technical side here because like there's not very many technical people in the office yeah. and so like I think that right now the like marketing and sales side is kind of disconnected from the technology side a bit and they're trying to fix that but the thing is is like support doesn't work in product really so like bringing another support person here I don't think is going to help we need to bring developers here we have zero developers here yeah but you know, it's easier to find support people than it is developers, so... Yeah. Um, I mean... Maybe eventually I can move to Perforce. Because they already interviewed me. I'm yeah. sure, like, the only reason why I didn't get hired is because I never told them that I'm not going to California. Yeah. Well, Savender is, uh, is my boss now. So, well, it's kind of weird because, like... Veronica is kind of my boss, but Savinder's Veronica's boss, so oh, yeah. that's how that chain goes. So I kind of figured when Savinder was interviewing you that that's what was going to happen, yeah. but they they hadn't told us that. So uh, yeah, they pretty much they pretty much tried to convince me that California is a bad place. <laughs> Did you actually have a interview there? In California? No, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah. No. Oh. I have like so many interviews. When you went in. Yeah. It's funny because, like, you were talking about how, like, dressed up everybody is, but, like, most people like it's the opposite way around like that um people will say that like it's like really it's like really like super casual yeah oh. but that's like just because like like i guess some people who like interviewed me were dressed up huh i guess like everyone who interviewed me was dressed up but also it's like when kevin wasn't dressed up neither was kim uh yeah, that's true. Yeah, neither neither of them dress up but, ever. Uh, also, it's like it's very like more dense than Nagios. It's like way more people working. Oh yeah. yeah. I mean, we're we're like a thousand people company. Wow. Yeah. I don't know the exact number, but it's well over nine hundred. Did the new guy start already? My all right, the new support guy. Yeah. yeah, he started this past Monday. What's his like experience look like? Uh, he worked at Code Forty Two. I don't really know what he. I mean, he worked in support, but I don't know. They worked on a tape backup solution thing there for sure. I don't know what else, but um, yeah. I haven't really had a chance to talk to him much because we've been so busy. Well, I mean, I was on. I was out of the office on Tuesday and then like all of Marvin's stuff um and I had to like go about on Monday before uh before the lunch with him but then when we did our like meet and greet lunch like we took two people out it was Kevin and Jerry and so like I talked to Jerry some too um but uh yeah, they're, well, Jerry's in the, he, he doesn't work on that team. Uh, I mean, he's he's a Perfecto support manager, which is like a different product line. Right here? 
there like a exit? Yeah, I see a little exit here. Sweet. All right, man. I will. Um, I'll let you know what's going on next weekend. Next weekend, I'm busy because my sister oh. is getting married. Okay. So. Ah. All right, man. And then the week after that is the weekend before July 4th. So. Right. Cool. We'll survive. Yeah, they can't stop you from going to Gabe, so. Yeah, we should. I'd be down like, uh, actually, wait, Monday I can. Tuesday's your last day, so that's a good day to do it. See? a little warm but for this speed it was good yeah. racing the